Now this is for the continuation of your July forecast. So let's take a look. Well, your July forecast seems to be a little bit uh, full of dramas, especially when it comes to your love life or marriage life. You will try to escape, and there is like a trip that you're going to be taking at the last two weeks of this month, or the last, uh, well, the second week of this month, okay? It seems like things are not, you know, it's, it's kind of impalpable or it's kind of, you know, like you don't want to exert any more effort, okay, in your relationship. And for you, it is much better to just take off and move on, move forward, escape, run away, and not really face the truth anymore, okay, because you're just too drained. You've tried so hard. I mean, your your partner still wants to make it work and your partner still wants to, you know, continue. But for you, it's like you have tried and you've also, you know, you've done your best to save the relationship, but it seems like it's just way too much. All right. Now, somehow, this fire sign that it's more likely just another option. You know that you only have this physical attraction and physical chemistry. But aside from that, you know that your life isn't really going anywhere with this person. In fact, that even in the past, this person have already drained out your finances, your resources, your energy, your time, attention, and everything else. Okay? They don't have any life direction, so they want to infuse the same thing to you. Now, since that your career will be soaring up high this 2019, it's already up to you if you want to get affected by this person, all right? Because um, you know what's going to happen and you know what to expect already, all right? Now... For singles, oh, most of the time you'll be spending your time with your friends, but financially, you will still be very successful, okay? It's just that it will be dawning on you that what if you will be spending your life alone or you're not going to find the right one anymore. The fire sign around you that seems to be like um, a little bit oblivious and obnoxious. That even though this is the only person around you, aside from the person that you're also trying to run away from. Okay? You feel like this is not really the, the only option for you. So might as well just stay single and just be alone. Alright. Friends will also be um, accompanying you and giving you comfort during the time of your distress. All right, now. Hmm. 
you know that you feel so you know it's like um you're caught in between letting go and staying okay you have tried you do appreciate the effort of your partner to make you stay and to make this relationship still work you know for the second time but for you there's just way too much pain and you know like bitter memories that you just didn't really let go of especially during those stormy times that those verbal abuses and verbal stuff that you know your partner had lashed on to you it seems like every day that you're trying it reminds you of those painful moments okay so you know that the problem is no longer with your partner but it's with you because you can't seem to let go of the past you can't seem to forgive and forget right now you're so afraid to trust in every word and every promise that your partner tells you you feel like they are just lying and covering up for something and it's been taking a toll on both of you and you're adding up a little bit more stress to your busy work environment and so as when you when you get home instead of having the peace of mind and relaxing and having that bit of a comfort feeling it's not it's even more chaotic and it's like you are going through right in the middle of a battlefield okay now communications will be coming there will be some expressions opening up discussion but for you you're not yet ready to discuss your feelings you're not yet ready to discuss the options what's the final say what's the final take where it's going to lead and what is the, the final step for you right now you just want to concentrate in your career and better it and you will also be taking a um like a like a sudden trip okay and for you to escape and for you to find yourself and do some soul searching right which is i can't really blame you if this is what you really want it's just right for you to go and find yourself take off and um you know take your me time now when it comes to your workplace or when it comes to your careers and finances you will recall and you will review the promises and the um, whatever that you have agreed on your position or on the promising position that all of the awaits you but it seems like now you're having some second thoughts whether you would uh, do it or not or whether you're going to take it or not you know that this is the one that you've been waiting for but you feel so stuck you feel so um a little bit um what i call this like thinking twice because of your personal depression and then your busy work environment that you don't even have time to think about your problems anymore you're looking for some like a quick vacation for a little while but the job that you have right now demands a lot of attention concentration focus and team leading as well now you will be making a decision to take a quick break however one of the key decision makers which is a fire sign will not take this lightly as they will you know presume that this is um a sign of responsibility that right in the middle of the you know like a crunching time and um busy schedule this is where you're going to be asking for a break because you just want to escape from the hectic schedule which is it's not even the case okay this person won't even understand whatever it is that you're going through but the earth sign will be backing you up okay so don't worry about it I mean the people around you they're just kind of envious of your success and whatever that you have already attained but just be a little bit more patient and you're gonna get there okay if you're not going to be taking care of your personal stuff and find yourself it will also affect your performance in work because you're going to be full of depression frustration and uh, disoriented okay so whatever they're going to tell you whatever they're going to you know express as a scrutiny and um uh, scorning just try to you know, just try not to listen to it because they don't really know what's going on with you now it comes to your sex life, more adventure, sexual possessiveness, jealousy, suspicions, doubts, and I also feel like you'll start recalling the past, okay? A part of you is not yet, you know, over, or you're not yet done done with the memories of you in this fire sign, and yet every time 
you're so paranoid that you know like what if you're gonna go home one day or one time and you're gonna catch your partner again in bed with someone okay and this is something that's already been haunting you and for you if you're not yet enough uh, for your partner if you're not yet enough you know as uh, the only spouse that they have then this is where you're going to be taking turns and the it's like you're going to be very conscious of your uh, of your appearance how you look like your breasts your body your fats you know your hair this is where you're going to be making a huge turn and make over of yourself not because that you want to be available for someone else but it's like you just want to love yourself again and be beautiful as how you used to be now singles you are starting to become bored and impatient with your life because you wanted to find the right one but unfortunately you keep on stumbling upon uh, the pretenders or somebody is just wearing masks or not they're not really for real even though your finances or your money right now seems really good and you are thinking of opening up a business okay and you're just waiting for the right time but since that you're a little bit like all over the place you can't seem to like put things through and through because you are thinking about a lot of personal stuff especially you know be so afraid that what if you're gonna get old alone okay well you know what it is much better to be alone rather than settle with somebody just for the sake of having a company because you're just gonna end up feeling even more alone okay because you get into a relationship for the wrong reason now there is a fire sign is still trying to you know pursue you but then you feel like it is much better off to be alone rather than be with somebody again or so rather than be with this fire sign again because um you just don't want to go back to the road again the road of abuse and toxicity okay now when it comes to your health still some dermatological problems eye problems eye sensitivities oh and even toothache and um some gum problems you will also have some problems uh, focusing when you stand up you will feel so nauseous or when you um, in the morning you will find it hard to get up because you will have a very heavy head aside from that you need to continue your um, exercise regime and uh, try to let go and uh, you know those burdens and depression and frustrations and all those things that you've been keeping in your head and this is the reason why you're having a lot of hard time sleeping at night you will also be joining some like-minded people or enjoy will be joining a group you will also be giving some of the things that you no longer need there will be some spring cleaning they'll stay too late at night and you also need to uh, detox okay virgin coconut oil is much better for you if you want to release some of the unwanted toxins inside your body and if you want to wash it off and offer some organic food and you will also be happy with the sacrifices that you have made in order for you to be a little bit more healthy and seafood diet for now and be very careful with wild animals all right let's take a look at your august forecast
I need to shuffle the cards uh, carefully because it's not really shuffling much. All right, August forecast. Let's take a look. Feeling lonely, running away, looking for some changes. Being antisocial, walling yourself up, and running away from someone is a fire sign. Traveling still, and looking for some. Comfort or like a, like an escape, which is you're going to be using work as an escape to travel. Oh, <laughs> looks like someone is going to get fired around your workplace, which is this fire sign person who's been bullying you at work will finally be gonna get sacked because of their um, they're gonna be lying about something or they're gonna get caught breaking the policy of the company serves them well On and off, on and off. Mm -hmm. Okay, that card flipped. Five of Cups, feeling a little bit like you're lost, wallowing a verb it's killed, and you feel like you're so alone during this month of August. This is for singles, okay? Wishing for a relationship. Okay, well this month it seems like you want to isolate yourself for a little while, okay? But it comes to 
when it comes to your personal stuff and personal issues you don't want to you know it's like you're going to be avoiding the calls or text messages of your friends family relatives you just want to have that exclusive time for you okay because at this point you're already trying to make a decision where do you really want to go you're already looking for a guiding light and you're already looking for like a sign or symbol now you feel so stuck about this whole situation between your real spouse and about this fire sign person that just won't go away okay now you're already having a hard time that why did you ever contact this person in the first place when you needed somebody and now you're having a hard time discarding this person out of your life okay you will also be using as an excuse I mean your uh, your business trip you know to go and travel and be away for a little while because you just can't really seem to think of um, like a proper decision or proper um, strategy okay to get out of the situation and you will keep on looking for more options and how to make yourself even more busier work-wise there will be good news and bad news that's gonna be coming your way the good news is that you will find um, your environment a little bit more at ease and relaxing and you can finally breathe, okay? And the person who's been smoking heavily around you. My iPad is talking. <laughs> um, the person who's been smoking around you will finally be, um, you know, moving away from you now this fire sign will be sacked or will be let go by your management or your company because they're gonna be discovered or your management has been um what they call this like investigating this person for quite some time already and they're gonna they're finally gonna get a solid evidence okay about them breaking the policy and there's also something that they have done more likely stealing leaking information and stuff like that and you know you're gonna be free from uh, bullying finally and since that there was a time that you felt so alone you can't really seem to you know take anybody from your co-workers as uh, to be on your side and now all of your strength and all of your uh, patience will start paying off and you will finally be on top and victorious okay even though you feel so guilty about the situation but then eh, it is what it is you know and aside from that there is finally a um like a negotiation or contract that you've been trying for somebody to sign and it will be signed and sealed and will be agreed on the end of this month of august Good for you sex life your suspicions and your doubts are continuously getting stronger and arising. It's not that you are feeling so doubtful and you don't know how to trust, but you trust your instincts more. Now, you feel like your partner or your spouse is continuously messing around right behind your back, and this is what you cannot really stand anymore. You're tired of talking, you're tired of noticing, you're tired of confronting, because all you hear anyway is just all about lies and deception and alibis, and they just try to, you know, turn things around or turn the tables against you. Now, this person will still try and woo you, but then you will also keep on thinking about that person from the past and even at this point that you don't want them both anymore in your life okay singles you are feeling so alone and you there is a there is an air sign around you that you just uh, that you already let go of and um this person just more likely just degraded you and belittled you and uh, you know made you feel so down in yourself and you are now starting to wonder what if you would just have a child of your own without getting married or without being with somebody because at least you're gonna have a child but then there's also if you're gonna go for a checkup or if you're gonna go for some pregnancy you know checking if you're able to uh, there's kind of um, sad news as well that you're going to be receiving so 
bit of a loneliness and depression and frustrations and you're going to be a little bit more irritable especially for the last two weeks of this month and you will also have a lot of sleepless nights okay you will start thinking that why is it that my life is like this you will start questioning everything in life now when it comes to your health it seems like the only thing that you need to be a little bit more careful of is you know being around wild animals try to opt out for some seafood diet and you also need to you know um, have a little bit of an offering because your health will start getting better except for some high blood pressure and nausea and uh, you will be sleeping more for the next few weeks or few days okay and again some eyesight problems okay which is I feel like you only need to um, get in touch with your doctor or you need to um, consult with a specialist about because I feel like it's connected to your brain it's not about it's not just about the eye okay that's why you've been having a lot of hard times and you will also feel a little bit colorblind okay let's take a look at your September forecast All right, for your September forecast, let's take a look. Feelings of stuck, meditating, cleansing, analyzing things, using your instinct, traveling still, celebration, happiness, running away, filing for a divorce, mm, separating for this fire sun as well, be acting like a cut off and dry person or you will be unleashing the air side, side of yours. Moving to a new department. I feel like this time there will be solid evidence and revelation about who's the other person or who's the third person in your relationship and you will also be cutting things off and you know like ending it with a fire sign because you're done with a fire sign. Alright, singles, fountain. The source, the hair fin, hangman. Uh, it seems like someone will be making your life a little bit miserable this month.
Five of Wands. Lot of strife and struggle. Finances for singles, you're you know, you will be rest assured that everything's gonna be working out fine and all right. In fact that you're gonna be more busy making money than making love. This is the month where you will be making the final decision that's really over, okay? You will be coming back from a travel and then you will also be leaving, okay, right away. I also feel like the reason why you're going to be leaving again for another travel is because you will be attending a celebration or like a, it's like a, an invitation from a friend and you just can you just can say no. Not to mention that this is... You know another way for you to prepare for the divorce that you're going to be filing and you will also be cutting this fire sign off once and for all okay you're a little bit guilty because you tried to play tricks for this uh, fire sign but now that you, you know it's um, you already get what you want the answer that you want that you need and that you've been looking for it's already there right in front of you so you're done okay and you will be feeling a little bit cold and distant, dry, and very, you know, very um, arrogant as well and irritable. And uh, it's like feeling dead on the inside because of the decision that you have already made for yourself. When it comes to your careers and finances, you're going to be very happy because finally that most of the things that you want to, you know, like for example, your team members are slowly listening to you and following you and you will be representing the company again for another conference or symposium the for the next well for the first two weeks of this month and there's also like the transfer or you will be moving into a new office or a new building or something like that but altogether there will be a big change or major change that's going to be coming your way it's a positive one okay you're not gonna get sacked or you're not gonna lose your job but it's a, po a positive one I feel like you'll be moving to a new department new team or a new office okay now sex life well you're gonna be a little bit on and off on and off and You'll be making love with your partner for the one run for one last time before you show them the divorce papers, but then everything will just get solidified because you will finally accept it to yourself. Okay, that this person will never ever change. And you will also catch them doing whatever it is that they're doing. So even if this person will try to please you and woo you, you're just done. You're just plainly dead on the inside, and then that's it. Okay? Because the cheating will never end anyway. Now, when it comes to your, when it comes to single Scorpios, feeling a little bit drained, running out of resources, running out of time, and you are, you're gonna have a lot of sleepless nights and um, feeling a little bit more battle weary. There's an air sign around you that you need to be a little bit more stronger because this person is not yet done done with their feelings and their vengeance for you. Okay, if you are the one who cut this person off, then you definitely nudge their ego or you hurted this, well, you hurted their ego. That's why they're going to try and get back to you. And aside from that, try to think long and hard about your decisions because if you're going to be so impulsive, then nothing is going to happen to you and you just ended up wasting a lot of your time and um, opportunities, resources, and energy. Changes will also come your way and there will be some minor adjustments when it comes to your work and finances. I also feel like if you are thinking of um, investing in treasuries and bonds, um, try to move it a little bit next month. Okay, not this month. When it comes to your health, I don't see any 
major problem except that you will be incurring some gingivitis and some bleeding in your gums because of an infection or because of an allergic reaction to a medicine that you're taking. You also need to do some spring cleaning. Your, your inspiration will come from your heart. It will come from your romantic situation. You also need to rehydrate and don't self-medicate. And you will also be experiencing, experiencing some high blood pressure and nausea. And aside from that, you know, you're all there on the right track and you're eating the right kind of food. Let's take a look at your October forecast.